it and even after remo uh, making it straight if you try to pull it down it won't happen so what you have to do is you have to remove this stand and you have to again take it to the uh center stand like the scooters old scooters and then you have to make the kick so that is something that i think they should work on yeah these are the simple things that even putting it slightly forward or re making this shorter or making this on the upward side won't cost anything to hello everyone welcome back to the channel it's been a long time that i haven't uploaded any video out there but today this video is a one year ownership review of this honda activa 60 that i've been owning as you can see here so i've been driving this vehicle approx 4226 kilometers out there and uh, it's one year that i've been bought this scooter and uh, in this video i'm going to tell you the detailed review of this scooter that what are the pros i face what are the cons i face advantages disadvantages what are the best part of this scooter and uh, why you should go for or why you should not go for so if you are interested in the video do thumbs up and uh, watch till end all talking uh, i'm going to talk about the riding posture of this uh, scooty that is very comfortable but uh, i think for the long riders that my height is 5.10 so sometimes i feel difficulty when two people sit back to me so my knee get touches with this so that is the disadvantage that if you are someone very tall and you are have you have even a single person on the back of you you might get a some kind of trouble riding this scooty so this is something that i have noticed else is the comfortable is Uh, comfortableness is very good in the scooter you had a upward riding posture and the it's very nice to be honest with you in, in ignore all that messy stuff because i've been it's a raining season so yeah that's why anyway and the uh, front tire size has also increased so that also give a very good grip on to the um road and now coming back to the advantages first i'll talk about the advantages of this scooter and later on the disadvantages right so first advantage that i feel about this scooter is the ref refinement of this engine being very an honest with you it's a 6g bs6 compliant engine and the refinement is superb simply awesome i must say it is the most refined engine that i have ever seen of this scooter and uh, you can have a look of the engine bay this is the engine of honda it's a bs6 compliant engine you can have a look here right so it's very comfortable engine is being very honestly very smooth very refined i mean the smoothness is far 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 better than other competitors that is ha it have the maestro and jupiter some kind of noise started coming from the jupiter i have heard from many of the people after a long duration of time after driving it but there is no complaint about the refinement of this activa 60 that is superb awesome second advantage is that i feel about this scooter is the body parts i mean the body the all the material that has been is very solid it's very good i mean you can see i uh, someone hit me from the back uh, so it got broke but else wise the speed was at 40 he broke it he push uh, you know uh, pushes me from the back but then also uh, the whole headlight is not impacted a small portion of the headlight is broken right so this is all about the material quality is very good talking about they have not used a very you know low quality of the uh, what do you called uh, the material of the body here you get metal but on the front side you get plastic so this is the very nice thing if you talk about other scooters they give plastic here also so that is really good thing and being very honest with you the build quality and the structure and the body parts of scooty is very nice i must say this third advantage that i feel about the scooty is the throw of the leds in the front uh, i have driven various other scooters as well but talking about the throw of this led setup is really incredible that is very nice i must say uh, even you can get a very good visibility in front if you have this deluxe model because this one is deluxe and another one i don't remember the name but that is not deluxe wherein you get a halogen uh, headlamps in the front but talking about this one this is led setup and that is very good i'm completely satisfied with the throw of the light in on the roads so that is very nice this is the third advantage of the scooty for the fourth one is that uh, the suspension uh, there was it uh, 60 was the first scooty that they have some uh, good amount of like they have increased the suspension i'm not remembering what exactly it was but they have increased uh, some way they have worked on uh, the suspension part of the scooty from 5d to 6d variants and they have increased the tire size also compared to back it have the smaller one but talking about the front it have 12 inch of tires you can see so they have increased the tire size also so that gives a very good uh, you know grip on the road and it it being very honest, 
policy it, it will give you a good uh, ride experience so this is the another advantages uh, uh, about the suspension that is very nice it, if you talk about the bumps on the road it you won't feel it that much compared to the other scooties so that is something that i have noticed you know the best uh, advantages of this specific scooty is the silent start feature that it have i don't know about the other scooties in the bs6 but talking about uh, my one it is the best right talking about the activa it is the best right uh, let me show you how silently it started up see and the voice of engine is also very good exhaust note is also very good right till now no issue from the engine no issue from the voice note no weird sound coming from the engine so all the things are very good till the time i have been driving this for the 12 months no weird sound has been coming from the engine and the exhaust note is as sim similar as it was on the first day so that is really good thing and you get a silent start up feature uh, so that is also another advantage that i feel fees uh, about the scooty yeah last advantage of the scooty i would say that uh, uh, the seat under seat storage that is have uh, i i'll not open it because a lot of my personal stuff is under this so i'll not open it but in, essentially this these are the this is the another advantage that is has a very good uh, ample amount of storage under the seat so you can store all your stuff under the scooty so that is very nice you don't have to carry here or here or here all that right so these are the some advantages that i face about this activa 60 after driving this for the 12 months and uh, for the 4005 km out there approximately 4.4200 kilometers so yeah this was my advantage now coming to the disadvantage any product you have in the market if you have advantages of that definitely you're gonna have a, a similar kind of disadvantages of the product as well so let's go for the disadvantages out there first and foremost disadvantage of the scooty that i face is the um, fuel economy of the scooty uh, when i was buying the scooty the dealer told me that uh, definitely you will get 45 to 50 kmpl of this uh, 99 and 100 cc engine so i thought it was nice i mean scooties have slightly lesser mileage compared to the bikes but being very honest with you the mileage that i'm coming come getting from the scooty is somewhere between 35 to 38 kilometer per liter so this is the uh, mileage that i'm getting only from the scooty i know it is very less i mean uh, the bullets have uh, approximately mileage of 30 35 so instead of driving this compared to the fuel economy you could go for the bullet right it have 350 cc engine it has 100 cc engine so that is the biggest disadvantage that i've been facing um uh, for the scooty i spoke to many active owners and they also said that yeah they are also getting a mileage of some uh, between 30 35 depends upon the ride i'm not a very enthusiastic driver being very honest with you but uh, if uh, you are the enthusiastic very enthusiastic driver you would get somewhere between 28 to 30 so that's it not more than that so uh, the mileage of the scooty you can consider round of 35 not more than that so that is very disappointing for me about the scooty and yeah let's move to another disadvantage of the scooty another disadvantage of the scooty is that suppose it's a winter season right your scooty is not taking the self it is not starting by the battery and uh, you've been trying for, for very long but it's not taking the self right so what uh, you'll do you'll use the kick but once you go to the kick you'll find if your scooty is on the single stand uh, it you cannot make a kick it touches with this let me show you if it is like this this mid center stand is touches with the kick portion so you have to remove it and even after remove uh, making it straight if you try to pull it down it won't happen so what you have to do is you have to remove the stand and you have to again take it to the uh, center stand like the scooters old scooters and then you have to make the kick so that is something that i think they should work on yeah these are the simple things that even putting it slightly forward or making this shorter or making this on the upward side won't cost anything to honda even it costs the very minute amount will come up but essentially they have to work you have to now remove the whole stand and then put in on the center stand like the old bajaj scooters and then you have to make the kick so you can see so this is another disadvantage what i face about the scooty and the biggest disadvantage of the scooty after the mileage is that 
instrument cluster this old very you know this instrument cluster they've been giving in the old activas 2g 3g 4g and but in 5g they have given this speedometer uh, indicator in the digital form but still uh, in 6g they have removed that as well i mean time to time the companies update the features but honda is removing the ad, uh, uh, updated features from this model i don't know why but yeah you get some boring this is very boring you get a blink over here that's the light nothing else you get nothing else no no digital instrument cluster nothing like very disappointed by the thing even i have complained to honda about this that they should give additionally on the 7g the updated instrument cluster but uh, i have noticed that uh, the other scooties are giving the full in digital instrument cluster but looking after the sales activa is beating all up to them so that is something the value of brand that uh, honda have that activa have so i think i don't know why it, Activa is doing it by Honda is doing this but essentially this is the biggest disadvantage you feel very awkward I mean you have paid 88,000 rupees for this and you get this you know bumpy old um, instrument cluster looking very historical stuff like that so this is not something very you know disappointing for me and these are the disadvantages of this scooty being very honest you the instrument cluster and the mileage are the only disadvantage that one the height one is not for everyone not common for everyone but these two mileage sorry mileage one and the instrument cluster one are the disadvantage that honda need to work on but essentially i'm definitely satisfied with the product coming to the conclusion of the video i'm definitely satisfied with the product no complaints regardless just the mileage one and yeah the build quality is good the suspension is good the refinement of the engine is incredible i must say the riding experience is magnificent i must say and this is this you know this is the best best scooty selling in the market so you didn't you couldn't complain uh, more about it and an under storage is also good tires are also good uh you can see i've driven 4200 kilometers but tires are still in very good condition let me show you the back one as well it slips sometimes when i would break rapidly but yeah it's still good definitely satisfied with the product if you are someone who are planning to buy definitely go for it uh, i was uh, you know thinking from a long duration of time that i should make a video the ownership video of the scooty but finally i made it now i'm planning to go for a motorbike and the videos will come of that as well so if you like the video do subscribe and uh, give a thumbs up to the video thank you bye bye